It might not be entirely unexpected for mining operations to unearth the occasional curiosity or two, but Tony, beats renowned for his gold mining, endeavors once excavated an archaeological find of gargantuan proportions amidst the routine tasks of searching for gold in the wilderness of Alaska. Tony stumbled upon a preserved set of mammoth tusks. The discovery unfolded as Tony was conducting routine surveys of his mining site, a peculiar object caught his eye, a tusk protruding from the earth, recognizing the significance of the find Tony promptly enlisted the help of his son Mike to excavate it using their specialized equipment, initially thought to be a mirror. Joan the duo soon realized the magnitude of their discovery. Tony wasted no time and called in paleontologists to examine the find further this momentous Discovery prompted a temporary halt. In Tony's gold mining operations, the presence of paleontologists became necessary to carefully extract any additional remnants and ensure the preservation of the archaeological site. Tony's willingness to prioritize scientific investigation over immediate profit underscores his commitment to understanding the rich history embedded. Within the land he operates on notably this find adds to the growing catalog of archaeological treasures unearthed in Alaska just 40 miles away lies one of the most significant discoveries in recent memory the unearthing of a baby woolly mammoth at a gold mining site the proximity of these discoveries underscores the historical and ecological significance of Alaska's wilderness the baby woolly mammoth discovered I dating back to June 21st 2022 stands as a landmark moment in paleontological history uncovered within. The Klondike gold fields the mummified remains provided a rare glimpse into the prehistoric past with much of its skin and hair intact the specimen represents the best preserved and first near complete woolly mammoth found in North America. Such discoveries not only enrich our understanding of ancient ecosystems but also serve as a testament to the resilience of life in the face of environmental change. Long mammoths, majestic creatures of the Ice Age, once rode vast expanses of North America and Eurasia, standing at heights of up to 11 or 12 feet. These creatures thrived in freezing temperatures thanks to their thick, shaggy coats. However, their existence came to an end around 10,000 years ago, likely due to a combination of climate shifts and increased human hunting. Activity, the significance of mammoth. Discoveries in Yukon cannot be overstated since the Klondike Gold Rush. Over a century ago, gold miners have regularly unearthed mammoth bones and tusks in the region. The cold but dry climate of Yukon provided an ideal environment for preserving these ancient remains, offering researchers invaluable insights into the distant past as Tony Beats prepares to resume mining operations in the coming weeks. Anticipation looms over the possibility of uncovering more mammoth skeletons. Experts speculate that these discoveries may offer further glimpses into the lives of these ancient creatures and the ecosystems they once inhabited indeed. Amidst the pursuit of gold Tony Beats and his team continue to unearth treasures that transcend mere monetary value enriching our understanding of Earth's history with each passing excavation as Tony Beats prepares to resume mining operations in the coming weeks. His commitment to conservation and preservation remains unwavering beyond. The pursuit of gold Tony recognizes the importance of safeguarding the natural and cultural heritage of the land he operates on the discovery of mammoth. Tusk serves as a poignant reminder of the interconnectedness between human endeavors and the environment as the sun sets over the Klondike goldfields. Tony Beat stands not only as a formidable figure in the world of mining, but also as a steward of the land dedicated to preserving its treasures for generations.